The design principle of contrast is used to make one element stand out against another. The opposite of contrast, the antonym, is called harmony. The principles of contrast and harmony are applied to elements on a layout. Contrast can be created in five ways. Colour, by using complementary colours. Shape, by using shapes that are vastly different. Size, by using dramatic changes in size or scale. Typography, by using radically different fonts. And orientation, by mixing horizontal and vertical components. Contrast can be a useful principle for a designer who wants a specific element to make a lasting impression on an audience. Contrast can make a layout loud and grab attention. Too much contrast can make a layout hard to follow, rushed and unthought. Harmony is the opposite of contrast. Harmony can also be created in five ways. Colour, by using analogous colours, tints or shades. Shape, by using similar shapes. Size, by using comparable size elements or gradual changes in sizes. Typography, by using typefaces or fonts of the same family. And orientation, by keeping the direction of elements the same. The principle of harmony helps create unity and structure within a layout. Harmony can also make a layout calmer and more relaxing. Many new designers will expect contrast to be the most important principle. Who doesn't want to make their layouts grab attention? However, used too much, contrast can ruin a layout. Designers use the principles of contrast and harmony to make engaging layouts that communicate important messages clearly.